Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper Sight. How the devil are you, mate? We have been rambling alien and UFO videos left, right, center, willy nilly. So today, we're going back to old school. We're looking at the paranormal, right? 15 freaky deaky videos that's going to scare you out of your mind from the channel Mind Junkie. Make sure you go to their channel, subscribe, and do the thing, okay? Now, this video is called 15 Scary Videos. No. It's called 15 Scary Ghost Videos Accidentally Caught on Camera. Accidentally, you may think? Hmm. If it's accidentally, this means that all of these are going to be absolutely true. Okay? Which means this video is going to be incredible. So before we get into the video, check out this because I need to look after you. Look, look, let me, let me show you this. This is all of my blocks numbers. All of the... Look. They just keep on, they just keep on going. That's because somewhere down the line, you've ticked a box or you've done something by accident or not understanding what you're ticking. And all your information goes to the big wide world of the web. And all that information goes to robo callers and spammers and anybody else basically that pays other people to get your information. And then they phone you asking if you want to buy this or get more information from you. It's a complete nightmare. So that's why I'm happy to say that today's sponsor is Aura. So what Aura can do is they can identify brokers exposing your info and then submit an opt-out request on your behalf. Now brokers are legally required to remove your info if you ask them to. However, they, they tend to make it really, really difficult. Aura does so much more than just protecting you and your family from online threats. And what's really good about it is really easy to use. So you don't have to download loads of apps just to protect you on certain things like, for example, password management, identity theft, insurance, and so much more. It's all basically in one app. You get Aura to do all the hard work for you and just keep safe online. So yeah, knowing that your information is more than likely out there and people are getting your information and selling it and people are making massive amounts of money from you and getting cold calls left right center it's complete nightmare and it's, it, it just makes me shiver inside so you can carry on letting people do that or you can go to aura.com forward slash casper site for your 14 day free trial plus oh by the way your the link is in the description and basically protect yourself online thank you so much to aura.com for sponsoring today's video so without further ado die daily day let's do this Go on, mind junkie! Ghost of Route 16. Shush. Residents of a small town in Poland were quick to share the following creepy video across social media. The mm. footage captured on the winding Route 16 is especially eerie given the road's dark reputation. For years, there have been whispers and tales of ghostly sightings along this stretch. The video in question seems to show just another unsuspecting driver navigating the road, but what they recorded terrified local residents. This is going to be the half body one again. <laughs> I think I've seen this 15 times. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, hang on. Was that, was that clearer? As the vehicle rounds the bend, the glow from its headlights illuminates a ghostly pale figure standing. Oh, no, you're different, love, aren't you? Unless you've a maximum enhanced this. Look at you. Still on the roadside. The oh. shape of this entity, which some believe to resemble a woman, could be easily dismissed as a mere road sign. However, look. To be fair, it could be. I just, as soon as you said uh, road sign, I was like, yeah, it could be a road sign. Calls assert that no sign of that particular shape exists there, leading many to believe this may indeed be a genuine ghost sighting. But what do you think? Is this a ghost caught on? Mate, these sound effects are going to another bloody level. <laughs> Cameras the locals believe? Let me know down below. Okay, okay, okay. The shadow. The shadow. This next entry was taken by a person named Kiana. Kiana says that one night at my cousin's house, we had a friend over. It was about 10 p.m. at night when we were all playing on the computer. My cousin Jose decided to take a photo of our friend and didn't think anything of it. Later that night, we looked at the photograph and saw something odd. Can, can you get a, like one of these silent keyboards? In the background. 
Captured in a photograph, oh, a mysterious dark figure can be seen standing. Look at you with your bloody ears! Oh no, that's I thought that was an ear. It's the shape. Look at you! In the background, Facebook users have been left stunned by this photograph, with many believing that whoever or whatever this is appears to be a lady with long hair holding an object in her arms. How the fuck are you seeing that, mate? Hang on, my phone's gone off. You right, baby? W what was I saying? Yeah, how the hell can you see that, mate? How the hell? How the hell can you see that that's a woman with long hair holding something? Huh? Stunned by this photograph, with many believing that whoever or whatever this is appears to be a lady with long hair holding an object in her arms. And the majority believe this to be legitimate proof of a quote shadow figure. bastard figure. But what do you think? Drop a comment below with your thoughts. Mm, okay. What was that? I don't know, I haven't seen it yet. The following creepy footage comes from TV Peru's news coverage of heavy rains in the Cusica region. Nobody seemed to notice that in one of the clips they showed live on TV, something terrifying was captured. Oh my god! What the fuck was that? What? What the hell? Oh my god! Look at your massive finger! Captured on live TV, something which doesn't look human appears to crawl. Oh wow, mate! Look at that finger of fun! of the water but what is it youtube viewers have been left scratching their heads on just what this bizarre figure could be some Jesus. believe it's some sort of strange creature but others argue it's just a very muddy person but what a very muddy person you think this is let me know guntilanak Right, okay. While we often envision spirits lurking in old houses, the restless dead are not bound by walls or time. In a creepy video shared on Reddit by Tony Way 1992, an eerie presence is seen haunting a home still under construction. Could the land upon which the house stands be cursed, beckoning entities from the other uh, side? Mate, I'm freaking out over this. I think it's done me some good looking at the bloody aliens and UFOs, mate. Because I've just had a, a, a minute, like a, more than a minute, to, to not look at the bloody paranormal. It's freaking me out. Yes, us! Flipping out. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh! Caught on camera just before the video ends. A figure with long dark hair dressed in white. Oh, it's the grudge bitch. That's clearly the grudge bitch. Can be seen stepping past the window. Tony Way 1992 says that this figure is, quote, a Guntilanak, a vengeful female spirit known to terrorize. Imagine seeing that bitch there, mate. Imagine looking at you. Huh? Mate. Eyes its victims. But what do you think? Comment and let me know. Oh, that's freaky, man. Echoes of the past. Pass, 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 pass. This next video was broadcast live on Al Rojo Vivo, an American Spanish breaking news show, and shows something rather creepy during the demolition of Pablo Escobar's office buildings in Medellin, Colombia. Oh, what the f. No, no, no! No! What the hell? Hang on! Hang on, I've got fucking everything, I've got all technology banging around here, mate. Oh my god. Moments before the building is about to be demolished. What in the flash is going on here, mate? A white figure can be seen moving at rapid speed in and out of a part of the building where Escobar himself was known to spend time in. Okay. It's probably a little... It's probably somebody just freaking out because the bloody building's going to explode. He's like, ah, fucking what do we do? Get out! Fucking what is it? Where do I go? Fucking stop! Don't blow the place up, mate! Captured in a photo. 
Snapped by a nearby resident, a mysterious transparent human figure can be seen standing on one of the balconies. The half-transparent face does resemble that of the infamous cartel leader, Pablo Escobar, who passed away two decades ago. Obviously, the condemned building had nobody in- Mate, that's freaky as shit. If I saw that in real life, mate, I would ramble it, but then shit myself, and then ramble it again. Side. So, just who is this mysterious figure seen on the balcony? Ooh. I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments. Ooh. Face of the Nun. Oh god, here we go. This following clip is rather bizarre. Uploaded to the X, formerly Twitter, account. Oh, that's that moth. That's that moth. Look at you. Huh? Mothman prophecies or what? Conspiration ESP. Oh. A giant moth with what looks like the face of Balak from the film. Fucking the hell. Can be seen on its back. It could just be an unusual pattern, but horrifyingly, the nun's mouth seems to open it does. further the longer you watch. Oh, so, what is man. this? Is it an optical illusion? It's even got the cross on its neck, mate. What's all that about? Or something more sinister manifesting before our eyes. It's disgusting. Use the comments to share your thoughts. Holy Ghostly moly. grasp. You don't need to be alone in the dark to have a terrifying encounter with the paranormal. This man, working in a kitchen, had... I've seen this one, mate people all around him when this horrifying moment happened. Like, like he literally floated. A lot of people saying he slipped, but I don't think you, do you slip like that? Do you raise off the ground and then hover across and that's a slip? No. Does he? I don't know. But then if he slipped, he would he would have hit his chest so damn hard on that corner, mate. Look, look at the angle. Oh the coat, okay, but he did he did hold the side. As the man stirs the food, he's suddenly pulled back by something we can't see. Well, I don't know, his left leg may have slipped. It's more likely his left leg slipped. If we zoom in, we can see the man's feet suddenly lift off the floor before he floats backwards in the air. The man, clearly shaken and confused by what's just happened, looks around to see what did it. I would speak to the manager and say, look, man, I need to go home. This, like, messed me up. I need to go home. TikTok Damn. viewers have been left creeped out by this video, with many agreeing with user Eliza Lou that at first it looks like he slipped, but after watching it again, it looks like something is holding his leg. But what do you think happened here? Let me know in the comments. And he's got Adidas on, mate, because that's good grip. All day I slip. No, all day I dream about slipping. Comment section. Poltergeist activity. Hmm. A haunted video store sounds like something out of a bad horror movie, except it might actually be real if this CCTV footage taken several years ago can be believed. Oh, mate, I miss Blockbusters. Blockbusters was epic. Oh, so I pick this one. Pick this one. Huh? Seven days. Don't watch it, mate. Oh. Oh, mate. Mate, this is a scene from bloody Ghostbusters in the library. At the very start, he bends down to pick up a video off the floor. He puts it back in his place, not realising how it got there. He goes around to the other side and jumps as a video falls right in front of his eyes. The employee tries to ignore it until he hears more videos falling off the shelf behind him. This time, he decides it's best to get out of there. He yeah. suggests that the strange happenings in this video are the work of a malicious poltergeist, with many believing it to be real paranormal activity caught on camera. Yeah, just pissing you off, making you, you, your day at work even harder than it already is. But what do you think? Drop a comment below with what you're thinking. Mm. The well. Well, well, well. 
Water wells. Oh, but God, we know what this is going to be, isn't it? The ring, bitch. Let's go. Come on, then. By nature, the deep, dark reservoirs of mystery. And sometimes, they attract more than just the curious. This CCTV footage might not plunge directly into its depths, but from above, it captures something or someone eerily reminiscent of tales we've heard from films oh, like no. The Ring. Oh, God, mate. Oh, here we go, man. If the ring bitch comes out there, mate, motherfucker, I'm gone. I'm gone. Just who or what decided to visit this well? What the? Oh no, no, no! <laughs> hey! Hey! Oh my god, Just look like at your little feet! Oh shit, mate! Look at the state of this! Look at the state of this, mate! Oh, that looked like CGI or something, but it's freaky deaky. Taking a chilling scene from the ring, a ghostly figure in white with long black hair emerges behind the well before disappearing into its shadows. Now, while this footage might not be genuine, I felt compelled to showcase it. After all, the ring stands as an iconic horror movie that many of us adore. It was one of the first films that genuinely sent shivers down my spine. Fucking right, tell me about it, mate. Absolutely horrible. Horrible. What's your take on this eerie resemblance then? Real or fake? Or just a cinematic homage? Use the comments to share your thoughts. Oh. The Drifting Darkness. While most of us think of offices as mundane, sometimes they hold eerie secrets that are anything but ordinary. In the quiet hours after everyone has clocked out, a CCTV camera in an empty office captures something utterly perplexing. Not a worker, not a glitch, but something truly inexplicable. What could be lurking in the stillness of the night? Watch closely and decide for yourself. Fucking hell! Oh, look at you. Oh! Oh! If that chair, chair moves, if the chair... What the hell? Captured on a CCTV camera during the early hours of the morning, a strange black mass slowly takes form. It hovers for an unsettling moment before it mysteriously drifts out of sight. Unsettlingly, whatever it is, seems to move with intent. So, what's your take on this? Is it a genuine paranormal occurrence or a cleverly executed hoax? Leave a comment with what you're thinking. We don't know, mate. We never will. We'll never know. The Nighttime Nuisance in the quiet hours after the final customer has left and the clove sign is hung, most stores settle into a peaceful slumber, but not this one. This particular store, with its rich history, has long been rumoured to harbour more than just merchandise. Uh, have I seen this one? I think I may have seen this one. And when the owners decided to install a CCTV camera to monitor the space, they weren't prepared for the creepy footage they'd capture. Oh no, okay. Oh, what the f- okay. <laughs> Shit! It's the same bloody ghost as their bloody blockbusters, mate. On a bloody rampage. Mate, they're in alphabetical order. Oh, look. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Is camp. that even real? Is that thing real? ...while the store was closed. The office chairs swing out mysteriously all on their own before an object flies off onto the floor. Captured on several other cameras, more items can be seen falling off shelves somehow on their own. Then, a mannequin in a glass box creepily turns on its own, setting off an alarm. This Ooh. creepy CCTV footage has left Facebook viewers spooked. Would you work in a place like that, eh? Would you? With many believing that this store is haunted, just as the rumours suggested. But what do you think? Is this genuine paranormal activity caught in the act? Or perhaps a clever ruse? You tell me. Jesus. The Courtyard Spectre. 
this next creepy video has been shared before. The video was captured and uploaded back in 2010 by a girl named Demi, while she and her two friends were playing ball out in the courtyard green. I think you can't pass this. <laughs> For to me, not, not no one else. To me. To you. To me. <laughs> to me. To you then. Oi, what is that? What was that? Oh, I've seen this one. Can you see that there? <sighs> yeah, I've seen this one. I think this one was a um a, a college not experiment, college project, I think. <sighs> Fucking oh, that, I think the sound effects are worse than the bloody image. That was creepy. Wait, what was that? As they're playing, one of the friends spots something in an upstairs window. Demi points the camera towards it, and a creepy pale face of what looks like a young man can be seen staring out of the window. I don't think I would say, what is that? I would be like, what is that? I'd be like, who's that? Huh? Hey, my there. Oi, my girl! he slips away behind the wall. After spotting this eerie face, Demi and her friends immediately inform the manager. The group were taken upstairs to investigate, but they found nothing. Even more chilling, the room where the pale figure appeared is always locked and not in use. Ah! Demi says that she, quote, couldn't sleep after seeing this figure. And YouTube viewers Ooh. have been left creeped out to f Many of <laughs> agree with Fiona that, real or fake, there's just something about this particular video that totally creeps me out. It is it weird. It just doesn't sit right with me. It's that staring, looks truly ghostly and so real. Those eyes that you can't quite discern, but at the same time, they're penetrating and menacing. Yeah. Most comments appear to believe that this is a genuine ghost caught on camera, but what do you think? Let me know down in the comments. Man. The figure. Oh, these are this good, next man. Creepy clip. I know I've seen a couple of them, but these are damn good. It's another oldie but goldie. The video comes from the TikTok account Rachel H Seven Zero, who uploaded this creepy video to her TikTok page after she noticed something strange while relaxing at home alone. So I was just recording this video because I just put my TV up, and in the reflection of the TV, I noticed that there was a figure standing over me. Oh, what? Oh, fuck up, please, mate. No, 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 no. I'm not... And you're seeming quite cool about that? You seem quite chilled? Look at that shadow bastard, mate. This is sleep paralysis, but you're not asleep. This is just paralysis. And I slowed the video down because at the end of the video i noticed it oh she's talking over it okay literally moves oh <laughs> fuck through the tv's reflective screen a chilling silhouette looms over rachel casting an eerie presence motionless it lingers just long enough to make one question its intent then it vanishes leaving behind more questions than answers just who or what is this wow Let me know what you think wow the banshee this next video was uploaded to TikTok by user Chaos <coughs> and went viral due to how creepy it is. While out on a camping trip with his friends somewhere in Arizona, the friends of Arizona, baby, come on! are awoken by the sounds of a woman screaming deep in the woods. I don't know. That was a fucking child screaming. Sure, listen. Or like a fucking woman or something. That was a fucking, that was a female fucking screaming, Phil. Please, please, please. Oh, no, 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 no. Go on, mate. You got a shovel in your hand. Rambo it. Oh my God. Phil. Shush. Oh my God, Phil. It sounds like someone's. You need to have that. Phil, that sounds like like some scary movie. I mean, I'm the biggest. Oh, you go first. Oh, dude, we're in the middle of nowhere. There's just... Dude, that sounds like some haunted ass shit, dude. What happened to the other steel target? There's two. Hey, There's one right there on the ground. It's on the ground. Boys. Oh, shit, mate. Maximum Blair Witch. What the f is that? 
This is Blair Witch. Oh, no, 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 no. oh. The friends. Oh, mate. Okay. That could have been easily made, but oh, that's given me the freaky deekies. Stand and listen, trying to understand what's happening. Another, even more chilling scream echoes through the dense woods, heightening their fear. As they scan their surroundings, a sinister discovery stops them cold. A stick figure made of twigs and reminiscent of the infamous Blair Witch symbols yes, hangs ominously from a tree. Suddenly, a petrifying scream oh, shatters no. the silence, pushing the group to flee in terror. Eerie footage shares by chaos Bloody on hell, TikTok. Man. Just imagine if it had like blood and guts and ball bags hung hanging off of it or something. You'll be effing gone. Sent shivers down the spines of countless viewers. Over 9.5 million to be precise. Wow. Many draw parallels to the harrowing scenes from the Blair Witch Project and say this is oh, one of the reasons man. some of them wouldn't ever go camping. Chaos himself <laughs> labelled the ordeal as probably the most scariest <laughs> he's ever experienced in his life. <laughs> wow. Some speculate the haunting cries belong to a banshee, an Irish mythological figure whose mournful wails are often seen as omens of death. But what's your take? An unnerving encounter with the remnants of the Blair Witch? Or just a clever oh, ploy for online attention? Could Leave be, your mate, thoughts could in be. The, comments. the house is horror. This next scary video is not real, but it's one that has been requested many times. You should have told me it's not real, but let's, let's go, let's go. Hi, viewers. The reenacted video comes from the YouTube channel Under Red Alert and starts out with a group of friends walking down a street when they notice a female in distress banging on a window. The group decide to venture inside the house to help her, but soon realize the house is abandoned and that no one is inside it. As they're about to head up Stairs. This happens. You know what? I think this camera has a light. Yes. Yeah. All right. Cool. What? Oh my God! Who slammed the door? I'm that? freaking out already, mate. He's already told me it's fake. You? Oh my God! Why is this house so creepy? What the heck's going on? Oh, you missed her. Oh, wow. Oh my God! Someone just ran up the stairs, dude. I think that's the girl that needs help. Check it out. Wait, no, I'm not going. We have to get out. <laughs> we have to get out of here, man! Oh my god! There's some weird shit going on in this house, man! I'm just saying. Fine! I will! You know what? We'll come pick you up after. Where'd she go? Joe? Oh. You know what? Oh no, we'll... she's gonna be hanging from the roof! We'll get her after. She we'll get her after! Well, fuck it. Where's she going? We'll get her after. It's fine. Yeah. Oh! Oh, fucking look at your mouth, mate! <laughs> A loud bang startles the group. The person recording spins the camera around, and a creepy figure can be seen standing in the darkness, watching the unsuspecting group of friends. Oh. However, when he pans back, no one's there. Then, the sound of the footsteps can be heard running up the stairs. The group decide to head upstairs, but one of their friends insists she's not going up there. The group make their way up the stairs, but when they turn back around, the girl who refused to go upstairs is no longer there. They suspect she's just wandered off somewhere and decide to continue upstairs. But then the girl can be seen being dragged along the floor right in front of the group. Terrified, they flee upstairs, but then the person recording senses something behind him. He turns around and a creepy figure with long hair can be seen. Look at that fucking mouth, mate. <laughs> Maximum mouth, please! Crawling up the stairs. YouTube viewers have been left terrified after watching this short horror video created by the team behind the Under Red Alert channel. Uploaded in 2011, it has since garnered over 3 wow. million views. And for many, it stands... That's actually giving me the fucking chicken, man. That's giving me the chicken a bit. It's one of the most spine-chilling videos they've ever laid eyes on. Even acknowledging its fictional nature, it's undeniable the eeriness of this video resonates deeply with all who watch.
Thank you so much wow. for watching today. Well, there you go, mate. Some bangers, some fakers, and some potentially real. What do you think, mate? Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.